Congratulations. With all this information, the nickname, the tattoo, the region, only one individual remains on our list. We have found El Invisible. Mr. Zamuro is indeed based in the Cruz province. Go there. Find the target, obtain his PDA. And there's no need for formalities. This buzzard can live or die as far as we're concerned. All right, guys, here we go. The final mission here in the Narco Road DLC, El Invisible. A super blood has been identified. The egg of an elephant bird, conjoined twins. Rare things, certainly, but rarer still is a person who can find a man like me. So I congratulate you, mercenary. You are talented, an expert in slaughter, execution, assassination, and destruction. Proficient in espionage, pursuit, and expose. And no less important, very, very good at making friends. <laughs> Your references are impeccable. Before his glorious beatification, Eduardo spoke highly of your bravery. Despite Tonio's terrible temper, he respected your methods. And Arturo, the zealot himself, was impressed by your dedication. These men gave their opinions without threat or agenda. So you must come to work for me now, mercenary. The operations of Santa Blanca need persons who swim well in shark-infested waters. Of course, you must first demonstrate your sincerity by performing two assignments for me. Then we will know if you are truly a calzón pintado. <laughs> Wait patiently, colega. I will contact you soon. So he still doesn't know that we're trying to get him. He thinks that we're on his side. He just thinks that the guys underneath him are falling from, I mean, one of them was a skydiving accident. One of them was a plane crash. One of them was who knows what, but um, interesting. All right, new mission, dead or alive, reach the mission location. Let's do it, guys. Over here in a brand new province. Here we go. Well done. This is the first time anyone has made contact with El Invisible. He has plans for you and will certainly use you for some dastardly scheme of his. Play along. We'll get to him in time. It is time for a test. There is a man that you must kill for me. You will find him at Putin House in the region of La Cruz. That is all you need to know. Okay, so we're gonna be killing somebody here. We've got two Unidad guards watching over him. Man, this Amuro is a riddle. Wrapped in a mystery, inside an enigma. All right, got both those guys, nice and easy, good stuff. We're gonna approach the house on foot. Let's see what we can find. This is interesting. I love how he's calling with like a voice changer and stuff. I feel like we're playing watchdogs or something. Getting all crazy. Secretive and stuff. I got eyes on the sniper. Man, that was a long range shot. We've tried to infiltrate this house before. I kind of like, but I also kind of dislike. I think I more dislike that they use the same houses for everything, dude. Literally, like everything is is the same as the campaign. They just re. Just spotted one with some. They change the name of one character. Change the the look of one character, and then call it a new mission. Like, come on now. You could put a little bit more effort in that, right? Last time he was downstairs. I got eyes on an HVT. In the left hand building. I got a target carrying submachine guns. That was where we found him. Jim down here. Hmm. I think he's gonna be downstairs in the left hand building. And see if we can maybe get it in there. All 
Alright, the gig's up. Let's go. We're gonna find this target and take him out. I didn't really want to sneak around anyway, to be honest. I'm gonna guess that he's gonna be over in this building to the right. Just an educated guess based off of previous experience. Ooh, nice little headshot there. This goes down. He's down. We're gonna have guys downstairs. Reinforcements are on the way, but I think it's going to be too late. The target's gone. Not in feeling the world already knows this. The Serpent has slipped away. It is possible there are details of his whereabouts on the computer. I suggest you hack into it. This should not be difficult. We're already into it, baby. Defend the computer during the transfer? Oh, shoot. Frag out. Get some. Damn it. Your hack has triggered an alarm. Uni data are attacking, but hold that position. You need to find your target's location. Frag out. Being creative with our defenses here. Frag out. Get some. I can't really tell which way they're coming from, so I'm just going to keep throwing frags. Frag out. Come in here to... Seems like they're mostly coming from down. We good? Eight seconds left. Almost done. Frag out. Love how the frags are just guarding our... Or top side. The snake does not want to be caught. I got a third. This is so sketchy, man. These guys are everywhere. I'm pretty sure we only have one way out. It's time to go. Us. We're gone, baby. Like a ghost. We are never here. All right, guys. We are coming in on our next objective. Flying around like Iron Man, baby. I love it. All right, let's go ahead and pull our chute. And uh, we need to spy on this guy. But wait. We're getting conflicting reports about who he is. Before you take him out, we need to know who this John Doe is. Pack their transmissions without them knowing, and keep this guy alive. You motherfuckers are supposed to be protecting me. The download okay. stopped. Out of the car. Now. Don't make this I'm gonna need this vehicle, cuz. I'm sorry. Sorry for any inconvenience caused. I gotta go on a spy mission, though. Here you are. Here we are. I do not feel safe. We've lost the download. That was too close. We're gonna drive normal, stay close, but not too close. We can't catch the stream. Download stopped. I was close. Unidad could have, or not Unidad, the uh, Los Sinama could have just messed us up right there. Get them both, though. Can't catch the stream. If we can find you a no wig and a false mustache, you will be lucky. And if I am unlucky, 
we get you a paperback. Mm. Will it come with holes? Or do I have to make those myself? I like you. I will cut the hole. <laughs> Damn it. The snitch is just who we need if we're gonna hack Samiro's PDA. I let him go, we'll never see Mr. Mysterious again, let alone his PDA. Yep. Event is not next. Well, that was convenient. Marking a tango. He's close to that local. This person in this truck totally just gave us cover as we got out of ours. I am pleased with you. Keep a low profile. I will be in touch again soon. Sounds good, sir. We actually already have his second mission available. It's right over here. Um, dead or alive. El Invisible has one final task before you can actually meet him. He needs you to disappear and become as invisible as he is. I guess this is your territory, ghost. Alright, so we're going to kidnap somebody. This sounds interesting. He wants us off the radar. I wonder how we're going to do that. Pretty much the only thing I can think of is fake our death. I don't know, how do you become somebody who's off the, the, the face of the map, you know what I mean? Like, maybe say we, we quit the army, we quit being a mercenary. I don't know. I think the, the thing that makes the most sense to me is faking our death. Let's see what happens. The problem is we have a lot of bad guys on us right now. We are going to draw a lot of attention to wherever this mission is, which is the opposite of what he's wanting. Got that. Let's go, baby. Come on, girl. They're still chasing after us. We're smoking, but we're going to be okay. Or not. Scenario. A test for you. I would like you to kill yourself. Please do not be alarmed. You were not required to die. Only to make believe that you are dead. Your heroics have upset too many of my workers and they call for your head. Uh, okay. So it is best that you work as a ghost. First, you will need a corpse to act as your corpse. There is a Unidad commander on my payroll who is now asking for too much money. You will find him at the San Rodrigo Monastery. Do not delay. Work as a ghost? I like that. A ghost ghost. So this is interesting. We are going to be faking our own death and we're going to be using somebody on his payroll that's asking Second for too target. much money to do it. Target. That sucks. What happened to just firing somebody? You just, you could kill him? Automatically? Now the problem with this is that we can't make too much noise just spotted one with submachine in guns. terms of setting off the, uh, the base, you know what I mean? If we do that and let everybody know we're here, we're gonna end up fighting and that mercenary is gonna be coming for us. So we're gonna have to do this completely silently. Shortage of corpses around here. Elegantly handled for scenario. Now take that vile toad to the car that Tonio gave to you, the one that you are known to possess. Once there, I will reveal the rest of my plan. As it is far away, I suggest you use a helicopter. Bro, what are the odds of that? What are the odds? That we kill the guy right in front of him, he comes to check it out, and then all of a sudden. He's right next to us, we can grab him and leave. Okay, so now we're gonna take this guy back to the car that Tonio gave us. Bro, this guy is white! I'm a black dude. I'm not racist, but that doesn't work when you're faking your death. Unless we're gonna be doing something to him that's so crazy that you can't even identify the body, but I feel like, I feel like no matter what happens, you're gonna be able to kinda kind of know the difference, even if it's, like, are you serious? Even if it's from, um, is he going to stay in there? He's probably going to 
on Steam. Like the, the, you know, stuff in the skin, you know, like from a scientific perspective, I feel like you're going to be able to, to know. What if we use nitrous here? Oh, nice. Sweet. I just had to get out and get back in. I was trying to take a shortcut, but I'd rather not get stuck, to be honest. Especially if Uni Dodd's after us. Which they aren't anymore, but... It's not worth it. Let's just, let's take the long route. It's no big deal, Trev. Actually, even better than that, we're gonna backtrack a little bit here, because I do remember seeing a chopper. There was a chopper down there, but it looks like there's also a chopper up at the top of this hill. I was gonna go back right where we started and hope we were gonna be able to do it stealthily, but this one on the top of the hill works too. So we're just, we're gonna go up here. We're gonna take this thing and this is gonna be a fast track over to our next destination. Three kilometers in this game is a long way to go, especially when you're on the curvy roads, because the, the GPS, oh no, don't keep going. The GPS doesn't take into consideration how far it is via roads, it's how far you are from that point. If you could go straight from point A to point B. So going up and down mountains and around the sides and stuff like that, that's really gonna be like eight eight kilometers at least, something like that. So we're just we're gonna take this chopper over. We are gonna have to land it nice and, and easily so it doesn't blow up, but that's gonna be our only uh, our only thing. Overall it's gonna be a much easier here we are, fellas. We have made it. Pull up a little bit. Ooh. Okay, I think we're good. Whew. Okay, we've officially made it now. I think. As long as we can set this bird down without blowing up. That's good, baby. Okay. We've got this fool. <laughs> Just speaking a bunch of nonsense. Can't even understand him. I'm gonna throw him in this car. I'm gonna take the driver's seat. Good work, mercenary. So let me tell you the rest of the plan. This car is filled with explosives. We are trying to explode in a few minutes. Simply take the commander and the car to the river outpost. Leave the car to drop one and watch your public persona be entirely incinerated. You will never get away with this! Save your breath for your prayers. <laughs> Dude, this is kind of sad, man. I feel bad for him a little bit. He's Unidad. I don't really like Unidad. They're a pain in our side, but... It's not like he ever asked for this. I, well, actually, you know what? He's Unidad, which is already corrupt as heck. But not only was he Unidad, he was a corrupt Unidad that was working for a horrible person. So actually, you know what? I have no remorse for this. I'm perfectly fine with this. This is gonna be awesome. We're gonna watch ourselves explode into a fiery death, even though we aren't gonna be in the car. It's gonna be sweet. It's gonna be cool. Everybody's gonna believe it. Although he's in the passenger seat, so that wouldn't really make sense. We'll probably switch him over to the front seat if we can, but it's a video game, we'll be fine. Pull baby! Wanna be careful here! Car full of explosives probably don't want to take it off too many jumps and bumps and Stuff like that. Fucking hell. Hey, to do this, Chico, but we need you to stop. That car just popped up on our list of vehicles used on a people smuggling route. We need to know where it's been. There's a chopper waiting for you at the top of the hill to scan the GPS. It's a big ass, so drive like a pro, and you'll still have plenty of time before zero hour. Oh, wow. And we've got Sinama on us. And we're going to have Unidad on us. Messing with the pool, Cabo. You are going to get the horns. I'm Commander Jose Miguel Alberto Carrieri de Velasco Franco. Dude, are you kidding me? This is so sketch. You're so hard to 
will have to unbottom your door to shit. Then I'm going to take a screwdriver and stab it through every organ in your fucking body. After this, I will bite off your fingers one by one and dip your stumps in battery acid. Following that, I will personally gouge out your sticking eyeballs. Skull fuck you to the sockets and go oh inside God. your brain. When you're dead, I will start on your family. This is the worst train I've ever heard. I will dig up her bones and make the gyro soup. I am Commander Jose Miguel Alberto Carrieri de Velasco Franco. No one fucks with me. Right, you want me to analyze the car? With the GPS history, we can break the smuggling route and save a lot of lives. Okay, so we have a three minutes. In 40 seconds to defend this thing while this giant chopper downloads data on where it's been off of its GPS. And then we also have to make sure it gets to its objective in time before it blows up. This is not going to be fun. And we've got Unidad closing in all around us. top of a mountain here we can totally cut all these borders. 900 meters we can do that. That's easy baby. That's that's chump change. Just want to take a right before we hit those guys up. Glitched out a little bit on us. I just don't want to deal with these scenarios on our left. One minute remains for scenario. Hurry, you are not supposed to die for real. Sinama, whatever you want to call them. We got 50 seconds. I really don't want to deal with these guys. These guys are going to cause major issues and they're going slow as molasses. Dude, my heart is beating so fast 
I didn't think we were gonna win that. I'm still running here. I was worried, even after we got out of the car, I was worried we were gonna lose that mission because other people in the camp were gonna see us. Holy cow. Alright, that's two missions down for Ellen Visible. Two left to go.